in the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful, to whom we all have to turn back. Honorable listeners and respectable audience, you know that we have started a series of linguistics. In linguistics, we commenced the chapter that is known as discourse analysis. Listeners and ideas in discourse analysis, I told you about the seven standards of textuality. And I explained and defined two standards in the previous lectures. Like I explained uh, intertextuality and intentionality. Today, I'm going to teach you informativity. What is meant by informativity? Listeners and ideas, informativity means a text has to contain new information. If a text has new information for the readers, it means a text is informative. If the provided information in the text, they are not new for the readers and the readers, they all have the same information which are provided in the text, which are given in the text. It means that the text is not informative. And very interesting point here is that, that a text or the provided information in the text will not be uh, will not be that much easy which can be boring for the readers and then the readers they will not take interest in the information and secondly the provided information in the text will not be that much difficult which can be rejected by the readers as well. So there can be a kind of moderate uh, words and explanation for the readers which can attract uh, the readers. Listeners and ideas, remember that if a text is too much easy, so then the readers, they do not take interest in it. It is a source of boring for it. They just read two or three sentences and then they say, now the concept is clear. Because the provided information in the text must be unexpected and new for the readers. On the other hand, if the text is too much difficult, such a difficult uh, words are given, uh, bombastic words are given there, definitely the readers, they will also reject the text. Because they were considered as, they will consider it or that kind of text, uh, text is a waste of time for, for them. So, to make it short or to conclude that, a text must contain new information. The information which is unknown for the readers. The information about which the readers they were not aware. If the readers they are aware of the human information, it means the text is not uh, under the attributes of seven standards of uh, textuality and that is informativity. So hope that this topic is clear to you. Thank you.